Hey Marvel Strike Force fans, this is your friend the Fasting Comic Guy here and today we just had the Villains Campaign unlocked, the new one. So I thought I would start by, uh, I just started a little bit but I'm going to do it all over again for you guys in this video. One thing I did notice, I was right in assuming that is actually very unfriendly with Sinister Six characters. Reason why is because Sinister Six actually have an ability. Basically, they do really good against uh, hero characters. And I think specifically more uh, hero city characters. And none of the people in this that I was going against were the hero type. So the first team is actually a whole bunch of hand people. Then the second team was a bunch of creep people. And the third team, again, was a bunch of creep people. So luckily with this team I was actually able to get uh, three starred and actually I was even able to just, let's see here, we need to get rid of them, cut them in combs and corrupt it with the final. Doom has spoken. If only Doom would be a freaking playable character, right? Like he looks awesome. So what I did here is I went after uh, Yo-Yo here first. She wasn't very, uh, what do you call it? Well, everyone's scared of Yo-Yo. She's apparently a god-tier character. And she is annoying because basically every time it's a character's turn, with her uh, passive, basically, uh, whenever a character does an attack, they end up losing a whole bunch of their uh, offense. So, yeah, if you can get rid of her, power to you. Now, when I did it the first time, I got extremely unlucky with Medic's Revive here. I'm just going to go after Shield Security because he's just going to taunt as soon as I get someone close to dying. Oh, damn. Someone... They messed up my team. I actually made it a little bit uh, more powerful uh, since I did this one. Well, by a little bit, I just leveled Graviton from 70 to 71 just to give him a little bit more focus. Hopefully I will get lucky and my Scientist Supreme's passive will go off and will actually revive somebody. But take your time, it's not like it's important or anything. <laughs> well actually, no, I want more team, more turns to go because it's supposed to be a 25% chance I think like four turns have gone since the characters died and my luck is horrible. So I want more and more turns to go basically. It'd be great if you would just freaking revive somebody. Oh hey, it's my little puppy, Lucy. Come on. There we go, I got a revive. Hopefully I will get a Graviton revive, because I would like to actually 3-star all these for you guys. Or you can just kill my Assaulter. Alright, let's see, where do we go here? Oh, it looked like for a second there was going to be a character revive, but... So yeah, I was able to 3-star this, so on my first go, but I guess I got unlucky this time with the uh, Graviton, but that's basically the go around for the very first uh, round there. So for this one, same thing, Scientist Supreme. And we got Ghost Rider here on our little load screen. probably going to get oh no we didn't get him again so on this one royal guards are the annoying part of this but I enjoyed I thought this one was a little bit easier than the last one although Minerva is in it so that sucked I also do kind of like getting everybody like super low in health because uh, 
basically that means like when they're all really low in health I can like kill them all at once and then when the next because a lot of times the next wave comes in like right now they'll probably be somewhat of a new wave no not yet okay Cause, yeah it's really annoying when like a new wave comes in and there's still like two people uh, pretty high health yeah like right there see kill Minerva and that's what she does. I don't like her. And when I did this one also the first time, it seemed like this riot, this guard here, actually his taunt seemed to last forever. I was like, why are you not going away, you stupid taunt? Because I just kept sitting here just pushing Minerva going like this the entire time. Going, come on, die. I don't care about this guy. I want to kill Minerva. Well, they kill my scientist security. Yeah, it seemed like every time I did one of these, a uh, character would die. And basically, I just got lucky with her Scientist Supreme's revive. Yeah, the characters that... I kind of left uh, Nebula alone till the very end. She doesn't really do much, to be honest. And she revives. And here we go with... Oh, great, just in time. Watch, this her character will just like shoot my sign to security. Oh, it is a tank, so it could just taunt and be like, okay, here you go. Doom's forces are weak in both. Cool. Reveal himself. Oh, look at that. We gotta have uh, Nemor uh, helping us out. So that's how I three start. Well, again, the same thing what I did with the last one. I just uh, three start, and I think this next one was actually not too bad, as you can see right here. Was there a Minerva? No, there was no Minerva. So this one wasn't too bad actually. Running from your breacher, Doom forces have flooded in. Hold strong. The first Legion will not give up. And then we got him talking. I think not, Ronan. Namor, what are you? <laughs> he gets Arg. Alright, so what we got here was... Now, it wasn't too bad, but as you saw, I only one started. I think that was the same thing. Uh, character. I think two characters just died, and I just didn't have... I wasn't lucky with the uh, revives. And yeah, this wasn't actually too bad. So I would go after the riot guard first. Actually, I did want to go after Ronan first, but the game was like, no. Ooh, maybe I can actually. Eh, I don't like that. There we go. So I managed to kill Ronan for really quickly. Actually, the first time I think before I even managed to revive anybody but I did that cuz uh, yeah basically what happened was yeah Graviton did his stun right away which was very helpful no leave my shield security alone so now everyone slowed they got tons of defense down Yep, five people are only left, and I got their healer dead. They all still have a mend on them, but that's fine. Now, if it were, this would be really great if I had, like, say, if I was allowed to have, a uh, uh, what's his name, Doctor Strange, just flip all these. But he's not a villain anyway, so it's not like that even matter. Well, it would be great if Scientist Supreme would just revive my security guy, and then this would actually be... A <gasps> Maybe, I might get lucky. Went from a one-star to a three-star. Nice. So a Ronin take thing. You traitor. Human barriers fail to recognize that the Earth is the oceans. No doom will cleanse the planet till it's polluted. Awesome, so I actually got that one three-starred. 
So after this, it got a little bit... I wouldn't say tricky. I think I actually just got lucky with it because if you look... Oh wait, wrong. <laughs> no, we want to do this one. So when I was in it, basically this is the team I used. Uh, all these characters, like this guy's tier 13, 13, on our way to 14, 12, 12, 10. So nothing special about him, but uh, yeah, this is the team that I use, and actually it worked surprisingly well. I think some people did would like to use, oh, actually, no, let's take him out, we'll use Moda. So yeah, I did like it quite a, This one was a little bit easier, although I didn't uh, three-star the Hella one, so I'm going to hopefully get her three-starred when I get back up to her. So here, kill Loki first. Yeah, this is def I did definitely use that guy, actually. Then he does a stupid stealth, which is just aggravating. Yeah, I think with my Hella it was uh, Thanos. He just had a taunt, and everyone was just pounding on him at the very, very end. And I was like, no, no, stop it, stop it. And then, like, there was one character left, and she just, like, looked at him, and he just fell over. And so, yeah, they just after... Although I didn't do it with uh, this guy here. So maybe I should actually swap them. Oh, look at that. So yeah, like I said, I'm kind of lucky in this that I had some characters that I had fairly well geared up. That's the team that I used for that one. And... Yeah, I wasn't really also impressed really with the uh, last, with the 7-3 rewards. Like, they gave you the, those, ep those legendary ones, but you got, I got so many of those saved up from, like, they just throw them at you like crazy. Especially when you did the Dark Dimensions 2 and the Dark Dimen Dimensions 1. I have a few thousand of them, so I didn't really... I wasn't too impressed with them. I was like, oh, okay. I was told you might get some of the mini uniques with it, but I guess not. Because that's what people are really kind of dying for, the mini uniques. I really want to kill this guy because he basically will flip all the, any positive effect that I'll have. Which is great, he died. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely going to, yeah, forget Ronin. Because this one was actually a lot more difficult to do also when I, I did this one with Ronan. And it was actually kind of funny because I noticed when I was doing this one, uh, oh no it wasn't actually one of these, it was a challenge I was doing the other day. And uh, Hella was the only person left and for some reason everyone was just attacking Greg. Like I once started the event but I was... Uh, I was just like, why is everyone just one like just attacking Greg? Like no one bothered with Hella at all. They just all attack Greg, which was great. I was happy about that. I was like, yeah, okay, just keep healing her because she was like had a sliver of health and it was Carnage. Yeah, it was the abilities one and Carnage and uh, Deadpool were left and all they did was just to keep attacking Greg over and over again. They probably killed him about twenty times before they died. All right, let's see here. I want to kill the riot guard. Nope, where? Cyborg, cyborg. I could have swore. Yes, there he is. And then I just throw, toss it on auto. I toss everything on auto. I'm pretty lazy at like that. These guys are a little bit annoying with their. They think they take basically positive effects and they toss them at other people in their uh, team.
Now, I think there is a Minerva in here somewhere. Yep, there she is. Yeah, she did the full a her AoE heal for everybody for whatever reason. And I did, I think I did manage to kill her before she got a res off. Yep, there it is. Now if I can just kill this guy, because this guy is going to be the big heavy hitter basically. Right now I'll kill this, uh, the guard coming up next. Now I don't like, also another reason why I don't like the guards is because, yeah, as you can see they're all doing a great job hitting my Thanos whose taunt is not going away. See, I might actually have to do this one again again without oh thank heavens thank you Loki you're awesome you just made this a lot more enjoyable because <laughs> yeah I really don't like having I did like the idea of being able to do this with on auto afterwards and just keep farming hella was it a three star did someone like oh I would suck if someone like randomly died that I didn't see alright so that was team yeah Mordo definitely made it a lot better because I had Ronan before. So now I can just start farming Hella. And may I'll be lucky and get myself a six star Black Bolt before the event comes up. Alright, now this is all new territory for me, so basically there's no restrictions right here now. Let's see what we got here. Alright. Ooh, there's Red Skulls. Probably gonna be Hydra people. Oh, wait. And Dane people and hand people. By tonight, Nexus Earth will belong to Doom. So who do you think is going to be like the cool people for the next one, right? Alright, so I can use Ultron. I can use Minerva. Like, look at this. I can, I have no restrictions on what I can use. Like, I'm kind of tempted to like a full team that I do have would be uh, Brotherhood. Got three good people here. Maybe use them, but take out these two guys. Uh, that, that. That should be interesting. I'll well, see what happens. Scientist Supreme is pretty awesome, so... Luckily there's no timers on these. And everyone just loves Ultron, so... Ultron's the best character in the game! Remember guys, get your... DD2 done and start gearing him up. Just toss everything you want into that character. Agent Col- Ew, Agent Coulson. Oh... Oh, this isn't... Very enjoyable. Well, I like to kill Yo Yo first, but I know freaking Miss Marvel is going to be annoying. There we go, got tons of. <laughs> Look at all these uh, negative effects just all over the place. Everyone needs to keep dying. Yeah, that's why I don't like Miss Marvel. She just taunts off, and when you want to focus on someone else, she's like, no. But then again, I got all these. Soon it will be uh, her turn. She'll flip all these negative effects. Eventually. There we go. Finally, just flip them all. Good job, Jughead. Oh, no, I don't like her. Get rid of her. She's going to, like, do a slight, little tiny heal and, like, revive Yo-Yo or something. Alright, great. I got myself a three-star on this one. Yeah, I'm hoping that for the Nexus stuff, maybe they'll toss in, like, maybe Ghost Rider or Bloodstone. Because that'd be pretty sweet. Ah, there we go. 
restart it. Didn't give me anything worth value. Hello, what were the... That's underwhelming. That's underwhelming. Well, okay. For me, I think I actually got a lot of the... Yeah, I got tons of that stuff. So, for this guy... All underwhelming. That's great. Uh, but that's actually... I need those. These I've found I'm actually running out of a lot of. So, when you're working on characters to get to gear 14, you'll be uh, needing these ABCs uh, quite a bit. Alright, let's see what we got here. Oh, I guess I'll try the same team, maybe? Although, yeah, I'll try the same team. I was kind of thinking maybe toss some Minerva just to have the extra healing and the, if someone does die, she can just revive them. Kind of, I don't know, I'm, I'm in like, uh, kind of mixed uh, feelings about the rescue, though. Because... Like, she's a really good, like, she's good for the power armor team, obviously, but, uh, she, I don't know, I, they could have, I guess they could have done better, they could have done worse, it could have been, like, a really bad character, I guess, but, I don't know, I just, like, look at them, just kind of, like, did they really need to do that for rescue, because she's kind of, like, a little farmable-ish, like, they have her in, like, the blitz stuff, but. Hmm, which one do I want to do? Maybe I would like to kill War Machine because War Machine's got some pretty big. Uh, maybe I'll be lucky and he'll die from a bleed. Oh, this is going really good. Kill that guy. Okay, good. I don't like Black Widow because she does quite a bit of annoying stuff. Basically with Black Widow when she does her ability she'll give everybody speed bar up and that's one of the main things in the game is keeping everybody, it was being able to go faster than the other team. And I just don't want to chance her rising someone. Reviving someone. Tons of AoE damage here. But I think I got this. Yeah, there we go. So they're not too bad, like, you know, I, uh, I saw some people complaining about it, but, yeah, especially these last three, I didn't think they'd actually be difficult. Well, no, when I saw no restriction on it, I was a little bit worried because, like, with the other ones, I was like, ooh, restrictions? Uh, like this one, you know, aim, uh, Sinister Six, and Hydra, I was like, okay, maybe it'll be like a theme, maybe it'll do like make it so that the Sinister, like it'll be like all city heroes since uh, Sinister Six have some advantages there but yeah Sinister Six will do terrible against these guys and this one wasn't so bad either so I thought when this one had no restrictions they're just going to be like yeah we'll just make it ridiculously difficult Coulson Captain America yo-yo yeah, okay Let's see what we got here I've been doing pretty good with this team, so I'll keep going with it. Yeah, I really love that Scientist Supreme. She is, like, when you read it, you're just like, oh, okay, she's okay, I guess. She doesn't do that great. It's like, when you read her kit, you're not, like, I'm, I wasn't really that impressed with it. I was like, okay, I don't know why everyone's saying she's, like, an amazing character. And then once you actually start using her, you're like, holy cow, this person is beautiful and I love her. I'm so happy I put like the effort into her. I am totally going to, she's one of the characters I'm going to try and gear up to gear 14 for uh, the next Dark Dimensions. And actually, do I have any, are they? So I'm going to do Ultron for Dark Dimensions. I'm going to try and do basically the, I have five characters that I'm working on for Dark Dimensions and then once I can start it, I'll be working on them as the next characters for the next part. Because I think the first few nodes is anybody you can use, and then it's like global characters, and then it's like cosmic characters, and then after that it's city characters. 
So I'm doing Symbiote Spider-Man is who I'm working on. I'm working on Scientist Supreme. I'm working on Phoenix. I'm working on Ultron. And I'm working on Minerva. So honestly, there's not too much damage there. There's definitely not much tankage there. But there's tons of healing, so hopefully that will actually go good for me. Some people recommend actually using the uh, this guy here, the Shield Trooper, because not because he's good or anything, but because he doesn't require any uniques to get to Gear 14. So if you want to get in there really, really fast, uh, you can use him to like get it started if you are able to get four other people. Oh, looks like I actually feel like yeah, I did manage to one shot this one, so that's good. All right, guys, so that's Villains Three, uh, Villains Seven actually. So I managed to get this one at a three star. I'm really happy. I don't know. I didn't find it too bad. It wasn't too challenging. Like I said, I got them all three star. Uh, some people I've seen on social media complaining about it. But I personally don't think it's that bad because they did Fox Next did give everybody a big heads up. So that's what I did for all of them in Villains the new villains campaign. So I hope some of this was actually helpful for people if you checked it out and maybe you're having difficulty on a node. This was the teams that I used. Um yeah. So if you guys like that, please hit the subscribe button on the left and check out one of my other videos on the right. Leave a comment below and have yourself a good day, have yourself a good night, and have yourself a good morning. Peace.